Today we're going to talk about the views of solids. And when we think of views of solids, we're looking at three-dimensional figures. So we have our cubes here stacked. We have eight cubes stacked on top of each other. Okay, we have one, two, and there's one back here that you can't see. So that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And when we're dealing with views of solids, we're going to talk about three views. Views, we're going to talk about our side view, top view, and front view. The side view would be the green, okay? The top view would be the blue, and the red would be the front view. So what that means is if you're standing up here, you're only going to see the red, all right? But if you're standing over in this area, you're going to see the green, and if you're up here somewhere, you're probably only going to see the blue. So how can we draw that out? When we're drawing this out, we're using three different, three separate drawings to look at this. Okay, so now we're first going to start with our front view. So just imagine that we're standing in front, but we can only see the red. So first, we're going to put our one out here to represent this one. And if we're looking at it just at the red, we see that we would think that we would see three red stacked on top of each other. So that's what I'm going to do. One, two, three. Okay? So we have our three red that's stacked on top of each other. Now, how many over should we go? Correct, we should go over three spots. Three more, I should say. Okay. Right there, that would be our front view. If we look at it, we see... We see one, two, three, four over. One, two, three, four over. And one, two, three up. So again, that is our front view. Now, let's look at our side view. Remember, our side view is in green. So, let's look at the green. Let's imagine that we're standing off to the side and we want to see the green. So we're standing over here. So, what we're going to see is we're going to see three stacked up. So we're going to put one, two, three stacked on top of each other. Now, if we're standing in this area and facing this, we'd see these two, they would be off to the left because they're over here and we're standing off to here. So this would be our left side. So we're going to put two more to the left. And that is how the side view would look. We have one more view and that would be the top view using the blue. With the top view, we're standing up here. Think of it as uh, we're going over a helicopter and we're looking down upon what we would see. We can't see the red or the green, we only see the blue. So to do the top view, we see that first one, two, three, four, blue, over. So I'm gonna do that right away. One, two, three, four. Now, you should see that we have two more blue that are visible. This blue right here that's underneath this cube, you can't see. So we're going to put two more below for our top view. And that is our top view. And so you, now you can see that we have three separate views. We have the front view in red, the green is the side view, and then the blue, our final, is the top view here. When doing these, it's very important that you do make sure you do all three.